everybody this is Errol here from the Thought Consultant. Now what I would like to talk to you today about is our ideas, our plans, our strategy. You know and many times we come up with some great ideas, some fantastic breakthroughs in what we are wanting to do and how we can even aid society, be a massive benefit to the world but there's something that I say a lot of us and the people I have dealt with throughout the years is that we miss is action, you know. And the action is sometimes the key thing, the most important component in for us to execute in what we are wanting to do. To demonstrate our ideas to the world, to people around us, even to ourselves. We forget that main component is to virtually is to act it out is to do something with it instead of holding on to it is to do something with it let it be exposed to the world to the naked eye of the world and sometimes we are frightened to do that because we're thinking i must keep hold of it i must uh, be the one who is controlling it yes there's elements of that but also the reality is that we need to be able to road test it to see is it is it viable? Is it real? Is there a market for what we are doing? Or can we create a market for what we have just invented or made or an innovation that we've brought about something else? You know, we've got to be in that position and have the confidence in ourselves to believe in what we are doing. And so be that person who leads because if we are inventing, if we are creating things, we need to be those those people, that individual, you can lead with those ideas, with those thoughts, with those, with that, with our actions, and our action brings about the necessary changes in our circumstances, in our families and friends, in our businesses, and the people that we are related to, working with. You know, these things are vitally important. So, having the most brilliant idea fantastic strategies you know plans everything worked out to the minutest detail but all they do is sit on the shelf and just collect dust it is a waste you know it's a waste and i wonder sometimes how many fantastic ideas have been invented throughout the world only to be put on the shelf until a later date and that later date never ever comes because the person didn't do one of the most basic things was to act, to take some form of action. And sometimes we think our action needs to be massive. You know, it has to be sweeping changes. Well, in fact, all we need to do is the simple steps, small steps, in getting our thoughts, our, our plans out to people. Just being able to take the small steps will help us to pick up momentum. And once we've got that momentum, then we're okay. But it's just us taking that first step, taking those basic actions that we need to be doing. You know? And I think one of some things that we need to do to help us take some action is to get excited about our own ideas, our own thoughts, getting excited about <coughs> what we're involved in. Because if we're just very laid back and, oh, I, I can just do it anytime I want, you're not going to be really enthusiastic in seeing something happen. But if you're excited, you're enthusiastic, and you believe in this can make a change in somebody's life, then you're more likely to do something about it. You will start to feel that you have some confidence. Enthusiasm brings a sense of confidence into your body. You know, you start to feel, yes, this is, this is something that I can do. You know, even today, even, even I just take one part, one step of the whole picture, that is something. You will feel excited about it. You will feel I've achieved something today. You know? And it's important that we are believing and trusting in what we are doing. So trust plays a part in it. 
with the action. You know, you've got to be able to trust that your actions are going to be correct to the best of your knowledge because you never know 100% sometimes that what you're doing is 100% correct. But as far as you know, you've weighed things down, you've understood what the risk is, act upon it, right? Trust yourself, trust your own judgment. Start to believe in yourself, yeah? Balance things out, get some understanding of where you are going and where you're heading, you know, you've got to know where you're heading to, you know, some direction, you know, is better than no direction at all, standing still. So yes, this is a fantastic time, you know, having those great plans, having those great ideas and not sharing it with people around you, with the world is a waste, you know, don't let your ideas, your plans to be sitting on some shelf or to be held up by some red tape. Find a way around it. Create the circumstances that your idea becomes vitally important to somebody, to some company. These are some of the things I, I've learnt. You know, and I just want to encourage you to really you know, sort of push out there. Take those action steps. Take, take those thoughts of yours and bring them into reality. Bring them into the cold light of day. You know, so, so some action can be taken. So just some of those thoughts I just wanted to share with you. And I hope there's been some kind of help and encouragement to you. I'll leave some links down below of some of the things that we do, some of the services that we do offer. And uh, if you would like a help in any area, then please use the link down below and contact us. We look forward to hearing from you. Please leave your comments down below and please, please press like. Until next time, take care. This is Errol here.